Hey, what's up guys, the books here again. Welcome to the landing of Lashima Island. We're attacking the airfield. We've got the US Marine Corps attacking and we have plenty of Japanese um, soldiers defending the approach. Look at the fortifications here. We are actually on a user-made mission and map. Uh, a friend called Pershing has released this map and mod. I believe it's available to everyone over on the workshop. He's going to be releasing more missions and maps in the future. Uh, it requires a few different mods. This one does not require Rob's Realism mod. It only requires a few additional mods that come um, sort of with the mod over in the workshop. You just got to download a few more things. It's not tricky at all. If you want to enjoy this landing, it is totally doable. Uh, don't fret. It's not difficult at all. It runs perfectly fine in the original game too. I'm running it in the editor. Let's go, let's go! Artillery is pinning us down on the beachhead. Um, decimate the Japanese stronghold on the island. God bless your souls. Alright, so. What do we need to do first? It looks like the beach needs to be cleared out. And we've got some serious Japanese artillery pounding us. And shit is pretty freaking bad. The Japanese are still defending the beaches. Uh, the constant bombardment hasn't put them to flight like we expected. No, sir, it has not. Uh, they're pretty well dug in. We're going to do a little old classic grenade spam thing here. When everything else fails, spam grenades. Most flags provide resources and grant access to new equipment. Try to capture and hold as many as possible. So, what this mission is also about is not only a cool historical scenario that is visually entertaining it's also an actual mission there are flags and maps that's why I would like to call this not Rob's realism mod or not anything else in particular this is pretty much men of war salt squad 2 in terms of all the skirmishes that we have seen from that game before but look at this amazing stuff I never covered any of the skirmishes in the game I started playing men of war salt squad 2 and one that had skirmishes in them long before um, long before I started doing YouTube videos of the game and by the time I started doing YouTube videos of both games I think the entire um, sort of YouTube was saturated when it came to original gameplay uh, or not original gameplay unoriginal gameplay one could say which is simply by just playing the actual missions themselves um, so I never really got into playing the game like that. So we're gonna still try and get grenades up here and stuff. Uh, we need to do something. This vehicle w was active two seconds ago, now it's destroyed. And there are troops and tanks everywhere. This is one of the best landing scenarios I have seen so far because it is utterly freaking chaotic. There are Shermans rolling down the beach. We have gotten some grenades up here though. We have cleared out some of those places. We just need to get more troops in. So that's good. Oh my freaking Christ. I'll have to say, Pershing, this is absolutely fantastic. You have spent a lot of time and effort in making a hell scenario here on the beach. And uh, hell of a scenario, rather. <laughs> but one could say that this is a hell scenario because for the troops landing, holy shit. So yeah, to play this, go in the workshop, uh, search for the uh, the mission itself. There are a few requirement mods that come with it um, that you need to download, but they are available in the workshop too. So nothing tricky, no major mods that you need to get or wait for download. It's a very quick and easy download. I'm running this with the uh, ultimate sound mod on the side. It does not come with the mod originally, so you can obviously add your own things to it uh, that doesn't interfere with the actual mission or map. Artillery support incoming on the middle. Keep your heads down! All right, boys. Got artillery support coming in. I'm gonna get my troops off hold position. I think uh, when you're on a beach. Oh my freaking shit. It's important to get all your troops on free move so that they can head out and fight the Japanese on their own. Rounds complete. Move up through the middle. Roger that, Captain. I'm not sure we did all too much. There's a few explosions back here. Alright. I believe the mission's about to fully kick off. 
<clears throat> I might have to split this one up into several parts, depending on how long it takes. Look at this bloody crossing here. Holy shit. We need to actually get through this. Oh my god. Alright. Well, we have secured parts of the, the first breach, but I believe they're just showcasing the rest of the mission now. So there's a big defensive line over here, and then we've got the airfield. This is a really nice detailed map. Look at this trench system back here. And the sweet old airfield right here. That's what we need to capture. Lots of heroes and stuff on the ground. Nice. So a lot of the islands that the Japanese held during World War II were small little shits in the, uh, the Pacific that had the only strategic importance it had was uh, like the... the uh, the airfields that could be built on them if there were any uh, because that would give you air superiority and with a lot of good air superiority you could battle the Japanese fleet and the respective uh, US Navy in, in the Pacific so some of the islands were also uh, heavily fortified to to stop you know passing by ships and such fleets uh, and there were also uh, a lot that had a very good sentimental value to morale and stuff so you know, island hopping and island clearing, a lot of the trips were like, why are we why are we taking these shit stains? Why don't we just bomb the shit out of them? Well, they might have something really important on them and stuff like that. Um, I, I don't think every single, single, single island was fortified and occupied, but a lot were, so. The Pacific is, uh, was special. It, it was special, unlike Norman, the battles in Normandy on the Eastern Front. They had their characteristics too, but the the Pacific was was not like the rest of World War Two. There were just um, it was a certain type of standoff. It was a it was a shithole, to say the least. Let's um, I mean that wouldn't come from me as a first-hand account because hell, I'm thankful I wasn't there. But uh, a lot of people were. A lot of you viewers out there from the U.S. and all probably maybe had a grandfather no, that was in the. Uh, the, the Marine Corps and in the Pacific in general, perhaps in the war, very common. Um, if not, you'd had a your grandfather's dad was, depending on the age of you, the viewer. And if you're old enough viewing this, then perhaps you had a father who was. Um, okay, we're sending in more enforcements now. Uh, the sort of prime waves have stopped, halted up a bit. I'm a little surprised on how I'm supposed to. Oh my. Shit. Dude. Dude. Like, what the hell? Okay, let's... Oh my god. Oh my freaking Christ. Okay, let's get some troops up the shingle. Or whatever you want to call this. Okay, we got right from the squad, close combat squad, stuff like that. Let's move from the right left. I think that'll be easier. Um, let's get LVT4 landing. Let's get... Uh, Buffalo, let's get a rifle in the squad, and let's get a close combat squad, and let's get engineers. Let's just send everything in at once and see what that looks like. Uh, and while I'm at it, uh, I'm just going to, like, plus up these squads. And make sure they're on uh, move at will. There we go. Now, this thing is great because it's got a gun. We don't necessarily want to lose all the tracks instantly, but we want to see if we can knock out some of these positions. Primarily the one right there. And I don't even, there we go. Oh, I had accidentally selected something there for a second. That AA gun is out, or that uh, auto cannon is gone. Let's continue shelling the infantry over here. There we go. I was looking in the center. Infantry. We gotta move. So I want to send up a lot of the infantry up here. I want to dismiss these squads so that they can act on their own.
That is the trick to success in the Pacific. Dismiss the squads. Let them work on their own. You bloody well know it, sir. There we go. Double clicking K is how to do that. So, shit. We got Shermans up here. We're pinned down on the beaches. Trying to get some cover and fire going. And some of the... Unfortunately, some of the textures here for the dead soldiers are checkerboards, white and black. Uh, I think that's because there's like a gore mod missing or something like that. I believe that comes with Rob's Realism mod. Perhaps it comes with the... I don't know, but it's a shame. I'm sure there's... I'm sure if the, the developer might be aware of that and might look to fix that if it's too annoying. Personally, I'm not going to care too much. Let's get a few more grenades over the top here. Uh, I'm sure if we have a few throwing hands here, some baseball baseball boys. Uh, let's also see if we can actually knock out that bloody AA gun because it is freaking annoying. I thought we knocked it out. Apparently we didn't. Let's get another LVT4. Let's get another buffalo. We gotta capture these, squad, um, these areas and unlock like tanks. For real. Let's get try and get two squads up there in the center. Here come two more landing waves. Lots of marines coming in. Sweet, sweet, sweet marines. Let's get you guys through the jungle here, because if we can actually start, like, killing off the people behind here, that is great. And I'm going to ask you guys to throw some hand grenades. I don't know how you guys are feeling about that, emotionally and all that. Can you use that gun? Can you repair it? I don't know what's going on, but we're going to... We're going to utilize every single thing we can here. Oh. Oh, there's some cool combat going on there. Move, 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 please. L.E.T., move, move, move. Shit, we lost the actual the tank that I needed. That's a freaking catastrophe. Oh my lord. Why is everyone rendezvousing down here? Seriously, that's a freaking Japanese tank coming down. What the fuck? Oh, well, we killed it. Nice. Good job. Good job. So, okay. Uh, some people are saying start from the left, move move, uh, move right. Um, when I say some people, that means uh, the actual developer himself. I don't like this kind of big kill here on the side. Okay, let's do that. What is it here? We've got a bunker. Uh, there's just so much shit going on here. Bunkers and that's a that's a gun. Well, we need to knock it out. And we can actually get up here. That's that's cool. I'm running out of MP, man. I'm running out of MP. See? Like, what the fuck? Am I gonna get to control you? Oh, he's burning. That's not good. See, now, this is sweet. This is cool. I mean, I like this, but... I'm running out of MP and real fast. I'm gonna have to start cheating to get through this, and I don't intend to. But I will if it means the survival of this, this this mission and the continuation of this mission. Because, let's be honest here, sometimes developers make missions that sound cool and look cool, but they never play them through. And, whoopsie, impossible to make. <laughs> I need to knock out that uh, gun back there. I can't see anything because of the frickin' smoke. It's like bloody Somalia. They're burning like tire smoke. That should have taken out the gun. Yes. Let's get the MG there, too. Let's get this guy up here. Let's, like, pour it on him. Oh, there we go. 50 more MP. We're not... We're out of MP now. Oh, my God. Like, why are you guys munching on so much... Or performance right now. Like, just... Okay, we got this guy here. That's good. Still being, like, bombarded by something. Oh, fuck. There goes the bloody 
tank itself. Well, this is just atrocious, really. Absolutely atrocious. Uh, we're out of MP. We just lost the ability to call in. That was like our last buffalo or something. We need to actually capture one of these zones, which I have been trying to do for the longest amount of time. We even have troops in here now. I'll do like a complete bum rush. They're all in hold position, so that shouldn't be a problem. This guy's detracked. That's fine. This one's two. Can't exactly repair you on the bottom of the sea. No, that's not going to work out. You'll have to sit there and pretend you're a battleship. We got lots of troops up here. Come on, Marines. I'm going to have to start calling in Sherman tanks or something like that. I want this mission to continue. And I would like for people to keep out hateful comments. Oh, Diplex, you suck at Men of War, I do. Like, that would be an over exaggeration. But I like to focus on the, the cinematic value sometimes. And, you know, the gameplay is uh, gameplay second. Uh, first comes awesome feeling. First comes emotion. Are you guys uh, stuck or something like that? So what's exactly shooting at us here? Everything here has been pretty much killed. Okay, so there's some Jap shooting at us over there. Okay, so let's. What if we? What if we just do this? Okay, I. I would think that that's enough troops to capture this zone. We're getting gunned down, and everyone's using grease guns. I don't understand. Why are we? Why are we firing? Why are we fi all Everyone's using grease guns. All right, so that did not capture the flag. Like, what do they want us to do here? What is the mission objective? Yeah, I mean, that's kind of what I'm trying to do. I'm kind of trying to gain control, you know. I'm, I'm just doing my best right now. Oh, my Lord. Well, hell, hey, hey, that's that's good. That's good. Just get in the vehicle. But, like, you should stay down here, probably, Mr. Mr. Vehicle. I'm going to try and direct control some here. Get a few more kills. I'm not sure what it's gonna take. I have no idea what it's gonna take. But we're gonna keep trying. I'm gonna aim a little higher for every time. And sooner or later, I'm gonna have that mortar crew killed. There we go. That's one down. What about this? Oh, there's a big gun up there. I should have thought about that. Freaking bastards. Bastard. Goddamn Japanese bastards and their guns on their fucking heels and shit. Oh, that did not hit. Fire for effect. I repeat, did not have any effect. Okay. Can we get up there? Can we aim a little higher? Oh, come on. Come on, dude. You're going to get owned. Oh, you're lucky they missed. There we go. Direct hit. Nice. Now, what else is there to kill here? Is there an MG gunner in here? Okay, so there's some soldiers on the hill. I get it. Where are they then? They're inside the mountain. They're like inside this complex. Okay, so we, we if we can capture that flag, we'll be fine. There we go. There goes that gun. Oh, we're a little untouchable right now. I'm gonna... I think we can make it. I think we do not need to... Utilize any of the sweet editor features <laughs> Calling in massive 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 amounts of units. There we go Okay, that's that's gone. That's gone and done MG position I am gonna hit him right in right in the shoot to bling 
There we go. That should have killed him. That's a bunker, of course. Granted. Let's try that again. I don't know how much HE we have, but... That's him gone. <laughs> what else do we have to deal with? That mortar is back and running. Fucking bastards. I'm going to teach him. Teach him one thing once and for all. Get the fuck out. A little higher. It's all about aiming higher. Higher, higher. There we go. Oh, come on. We have repositioned ourselves, so that might be a disadvantage here. There we go. That mortar is gone. Now, what else do we need to clear out here, to be exact? Last time I thought we had everything pretty much d done and dealt with. All right, so I'm going to try now and move to the left here without losing my vehicle, I think. We stand a pretty good chance of not doing that unless we get hit by a bazooka in the left or something like that. So far, I think we'll be fine. I think, yes, I think we have... Perfect. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. All right, so let's see if we can knock these guys out. There are people in the mountain here that I cannot see. I have no idea where they are. Or what their deal is. But right now all I care about is capturing this freaking place. We got some marines here that are desperately in need of reinforcements. And Uncle Sam won't grant us any. Unless, my friends, unless... Unless we show some progress. Still one guy alive in here, I think. But that should be done. Let's let's just see. Let's just take two guys. Send him up. Uh, no. It does not work. Oh, there's, there's a fucker alive down there. There we go. Well, that weren't the MG. You know, bloody hell, that was a good capture. Oh, fuck. Okay. Because I love my LVT. I don't like this guy sitting around here. He should have some He should have some action. There we go. But he... Did he repair? What happened? He's moving. Why is this guy moving? I thought he lost his tracks. Why is there water all around him? Oh man, dude, I will replace you. You were a little funky down the donkey. Oh, guys. Like, hear your complaints. We're trying to actually get through this mission now. So. Got a lot of Marines over here. Kind of pinned, sitting duck. We're just trying to do something. We're just trying to save the scenario. Uh, let's let's uh, let's spoil ourselves with some more reinforcements. I think we've uh, we've tried. We've really tried. But there's there's some. Oh, that's a bazooka. There's something that does not want us to succeed right now. Love my marines though. They're cool. I think we might have to clear up more of this. And honestly, these people in here, I don't know where they are, what their names are. There we go. Is that going to work? Because there was no way I could kill them. There's no way I could get to them. Like, they were glitched or something inside the rock. See, that still doesn't allow us to capture this flag. We've pretty much secured the entire left. Do we need to kill more? There might be a, a slight chance that we have to actually eliminate. We need to exterminate the Japanese presence on the side. I'll give that a shot. Otherwise, this mission might not be fully functional. Look at those 30 cows firing away. And you guys, Mr. Green. I'm gonna... Oh, that is wrong. That's Mr. Green. I'm gonna take quick control of you guys and... Have you guys do some good. No, there's not a lot of you left, but there are still massive bombardments going down on the beach here. Which I think is a little crazy. Get 
come on. One more shot and you are done deal. Come on, dude. Oh, this is the struggle is real, guys. The struggle is actually real. Shit, they're shooting a turret gunner. The one guy who can actually kill them all. They got him. They got him. Get out of here. That's too cool. That should be a done deal, right? There's a guy down there. Look, 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 look. They're gonna de deal with him. Get him, get him, boys. He's right there. There we go. And what if I hit the tree? Okay, so, seriously. If this isn't considered secured now that we can take this hill, then I don't know what's wrong. I don't know what's wrong. <laughs> okay, seriously, you too. There we go, just get up. Okay, everyone needs a little helping hand sometimes. Let's get these two guys up here. We have secured the left side. This please give us more reinforcements. All right guys. I'm gonna see you guys in part two We're gonna continue taking down this island and I'm gonna call Uncle Sam right now He's gonna grant us the reinforcements. We deserve we have like barely any troops left now. This mission is devastatingly hard They're all like killing us. We bloody well deserve it. See you guys soon again. Ciao